Hey, what's going on, people? Welcome back to another episode of Vehicles of Greenville. Today, I'm here with Hyperkin120, and he, yes, he is back doing VOG episodes with me. He could say hello. Hello. So glad to be back. Yeah, it's so glad to have you back, Hyper. So today, we're going to be reviewing the, the soccer mom of the series, the, uh, the 2003 Falcon Breeze, also known as, I think, the 2003 or 2004. For um Ford Windstar. So yeah guys, uh hyper, are you excited for today's episode? Uh yes, I'm excited to be back and I'm excited to be out. Alright, let's get started, lads. So hyper, what do you overall think of this car and what do you like about it? Well, um as a sort of a young like McVans, and um this is just like the OG of them in my opinion. And it's got the um, roof rack, it's got the um, like trunk, it's got the uh, two doors. Two doors? Two. Well, I mean it's a minivan, so um, one yeah. door. That's so that, got, um, that's something I always found unique. Um, the minivans actually have a sliding door instead of it instead of it being pulled, so so that more families can access the yeah. back and the middle. So, anyways, uh, do you have any more features? That you like? Uh, well, um, I don't know, the, uh, the hood, I don't know, I don't know what it said, but, um, the, uh, tire, or, okay, the, um, but the bumper right beneath the door, so, um, I don't think that's a bumper. Oh. <laughs> I think, I think this is just to go with the design and all. Uh. But anyways, here are my thoughts. I think this this thing is overall okay, but uh, yeah, uh, I really like how I really like our color choices and how they like like match in terms sort of, of pop out on. at you. Yeah, they, they they like pop out at you. And I and I'm 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 actually a large fan of this like design right here. This little this little yeah, like, I am too. portion. This little portion of the of the gray and white. I'm I'm actually a, a large fan of that, and um, just uh, yeah, that's basically everything I have to say. <laughs> everything I have to say. So yeah, guys, let's get started with this car. Okay, that's the startup. Let's honk. That horn, that horn, that horn was used so many times in the last Greenville, like the the Greenville before this one, the GP3. Oh my God, I know, right? Yeah, it was used a lot. It was used on like 90% of the cars on their roster. So yeah, yeah, well, yeah let's rev. I swear to God, the rev, the, the that's the same rev, the same rev. It sounds like a V6. Sounds like a V6 10 liter. Rev. That rev sounds like a V6 4 liter, if you ask me. Yeah. But anyways, guys, let's uh, just pull out of the fire station here. And if you guys ask, if you guys ask why I, I did this at a fire station, it's because uh, it's because there I I wanted to look like we we were in a studio. I wanted to look like we were in like an actual shop. Yep. Uh, how do you shift gears again? Uh, I think it's Q. Well, if you to shift to shift down, it, it's it's Q. To shift up, it's E. Dude, you went the wrong oh, way. Oh, that way. We're gonna be going to toys t toys for trucks today. Uh oh. Hey Dad, I'm recording a video with a friend right now. Just, just peacefully waiting for the red light. Oh, I could have turned. I actually could. All right, let's go. Whoa. Yep, I saw that. I saw that. I saw that. We need to do I'm that okay. speed. We need to do that speed test over. 
so I'm gonna run a big timer. You know what? Never mind. I'll just I'll just count in my I'll just count in my head. What are you doing back there? Actually, hang on. I'm going to set the uh, stopwatch on. I have a stopwatch on my. All right. All right. Let's go. Yeah. yeah. Wait, wait, wait. I didn't start it. I got it. I didn't start it, dude. Right. Starting it now. Wow, it took it took a very long time to get to sixty. It, it took over ten seconds. Oh God, there's a cop. There's a cop. There's a cop. Dude, watch it. What? You better watch your back. Hang on. From Ron, I'm. I can't mute my mic anymore. Uh, can we do that clip over again? The, 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 top, the top about. speed, the top speed is 105 miles per hour. Right. And uh, I'll be waiting for you at Toys for Trucks, right? Yep. Alright. I got a cop on my tail. Oh no. I'm obeying. Alright everyone, so here we are at Toys for Trucks. And um, there's a bunch of features that we didn't talk about that we, sh that we probably should discuss. So I'm gonna go first. Um, I like I like um, what we said uh, on how the color, the neon color is like popping out at you, and I'm a, I'm a, I'm actually a, a fan of these of these rear lights. I kind of I kind of like these I kind of like these tail lights, and um, and I realized I left my reversing lights on. That's just lovely. But anyways, here are our license plates: DDW-844, and yours is VFI-999. Probably pretty iconic because because of the the locomotive names in it because yours has a dash nine mine has a dash eight get it <laughs> yeah i get it yeah so here's the falcon logo uh, uh uh predecessor to ford and here's the grill design i think i think this minivan is overall perfect but the but the main thing yeah, the, the main thing um main thing that I want to that I want to discuss that makes it like a key to a 2003 factored car is how these is how these lights don't like curve up as much as 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 most of the uh, the cars do to this day because um yeah because yeah, it because being that curved curved lights that go downward are, are more of a millennial of a millennial type car thing I think yep. I think I think I think it's pretty common on 2003 minivans like this one. Oh uh, hey dude. Yeah. Look. What? Right behind you, right there. Oh my God, it's him again. Um. Should this not just go into the bloopers? Yeah, let's just let. Yeah, that should that should just go into the bloopers. And I'm gonna get this on recording. Please. Please. Okay. Like I like how he's I like how he's agreed. Like oh he's my God! If that sheriff car comes over here, guys, guys, this recording is definitely going into the bloopers. Just a quick heads right. up. This, this recording is definitely going into the bloopers. Wait, are you keeping this for the actual video? Yeah. Oh, okay. To make it more funny. But but anyways guys the last feature the, f the last feature that to notice is these uh, extra lights down at the bottom and I noticed something they don't they're not actually seen on the front they actually go way off to the side um, which oh, is geez, probably which is probably seen on a, on a few cars from the from the millennial era from like 2002 to 2007 yeah that, okay. that's pretty that's pretty common on millennial cars. So yeah, hyper. Let's just uh go back to where we started to end the video, shall okay. we? Yep. Oh, I almost forgot. Um. Uh, we do this all the time. So, uh, guys, before we leave and go back to um where we came from, uh, to start the video off, um, we need to give a zero to ten rating, and um, I'll go first. I'll give this a uh. I'll give this a nine since it's almost like perfect. It's a perfect minivan. I'll give for the it an eight out of ten. An eight out of ten? What's your reason? Yeah. Um, the reason for the um. Actually, I changed my mind. I think I'll go with. With a nine. 
All right, guys. Yeah, we, ap oh. we apologize. Sorry. We apologize for that cutoff of recording. Um, apparently, Bandy Cam only has a has a 10, 10 minute limit. So, um, yeah, we're just gonna continue off with the episode. I think we left off at the part when when you were rating the zero to ten. So, would you like to continue yeah, um, on that? I, yeah. Um, if I remember, I gave. I think I gave us like an eight or a nine out of ten. Yeah, I think I gave it a nine out. I think I gave it a nine as well. So, uh, that that I think that I think that's that's it. I think that's all we had to do. So I think we should just drive back to where we started. All right. No. Where did we start? Yeah. Uh, uh, at the um. Oh, the fire, fire station. station. The fire station. Yeah. The, All right. Um, EMT, All right. EMS fire station. Whatever you want to call it. This is, guys. This is gonna be a time lapse. Okay. Whoa. Never mind. This is not gonna be a time lapse. Yeah, the, oh, not this one, uh... You forgot to... You ran that red light, mister. Oh, did I? Oh, Jesus Christ! That doesn't matter, There's turn so green. Many, there are so many fast cars on the road right now. Most of them are in the opposite lane. Yeah, they're not driving right. And another! Bro, it almost made me crash. Like, what? Yeah, that white one? Yeah, I'm pretty sure that was my friend. Cause she also owns a BMW that's white. Yeah, most, I mean, they, I'm not trying to make assumptions, but the people who are driving on the wrong side could be from Europe. Cause in Europe, they drive on the left side. In America, we drive on what's left. <laughs> well, mainly they, they could, they, uh, you don't know for sure because some people are actually bad drivers and don't know how to drive. That's true. Why is a fire truck there? Probably because yep. we're at a fire station. I might get the fire truck again. Yeah, simulating fire trucks was fun. Yeah. Alright guys, that does it for today's episode of VOG. And if you like what you saw, then click the like button. And if you didn't like what you, like what you saw, you could dislike it. That's fine as well. And, uh... Yeah, if you want to see more, like, um, comment on any suggestions, and uh, turn on notifications, and subscribe to this YouTube channel. And uh, without further ado, we'll see you in the next video. See ya!